Hello and welcome to Chatelaine Makes. I'm Lorraine and I'd like to welcome in all my subscribers, new and uh, returning. And I'm just going to remove my glasses because it's got too much glare. Uh, this is a short video just to let you know uh, what's been going on. I've been absent for a bit, uh, have been kind of feeling under the weather. Um, and nothing in particular. Uh, my shoulder is uh, slowly getting better. Um, I still am able to knit and crochet. And uh, I am have been working on a corner to corner lap blanket using up my stash. Some of the colors. And right now I'm just working on getting the two corners so that I've got it up that as far up high as I want to go. Now I'm just working on to get these corners together. And also, too, I will be doing my first live uh, on the next on next Thursday, the twenty second, at two p.m. Uh, Mountain Daylight Time, which is uh, four p.m. Eastern Standard Time, or one p.m. Pacific Time. Uh, other than that, you'd have to check your uh, check Google to find out what time it is in your area and I hope that you can come join me um, it, it's just a, a way to intermingle with my viewers and subscribers and uh, everybody likes to uh, participate in live um, some just uh, sit back and uh, read the comments and listen um, other people uh, participate so I'm hoping that uh, you'll be able to come and join me I am uh, hoping to do at least one live a month um, possibly two depending on how well uh, the live goes also too I am doing a um, collab with another YouTube content provider um, it is still in the works uh, what we plan on doing is um, each each one alter alter off uh, using the um, live to show our progress on our projects. So one time it would be me hosting the live, and the next time it would be the person that I am doing the collab with. So you can uh, keep an eye out for that. Um, I do plan on uh, selling my um, my works, my hand dyes, and uh, some of my other uh, projects that I have made. Um, that is still in the works. I've. Um, between myself and my daughter have come up with business cards uh, which I still would need to print off and she is working on setting up a website for me uh, which of course will be called uh, Chatelaine Makes uh, so yeah that's not too much else going on uh, I do have my first COVID a vaccine shot uh, booked for the 28th of this month so I'm looking forward to being able to get back to a normal life uh, where I don't have to go around and worry about catching or, or um, giving the virus to someone else and uh, I, I'm looking very forward to being able to visit with my family so, 
I think that is uh, all I have. I am going to be uploading a uh, a knitting tutorial, which is overdue. Um, I was planning on doing it today, but uh, I fell asleep and uh, still kind of tired. Um, but as long as nothing else happens tomorrow, I will be doing that tutorial uh, where I show you how to knit a uh, dishcloth that's made on the diagonal and I did have it here beside me but it's not there right now um, trying to think oh and I will also be doing another yarn dyeing video um, using the microwave so you can look for that so it's getting late here and I am tired again so I'm going to uh, sign off uh, and catch you next time Oh, one other thing. I do have on my subscriber count just over the 100 mark. I did have um, some subscribers before I started doing my content. So once I actually get to 100 new subscribers for me, um, I will be doing a giveaway on the next video. So, uh, if you could watch my videos for their entirety, um, because you never know when that uh, number will come up. Um, I'm not letting you know how many subscribers I had before I started. Um, I do want to give back to my subscribers that are here um, to watch my content, uh, learn from what I put out and uh, I want to give back so um, like I said you won't know but um, if you want to partake uh, I don't know how big the the um, giveaway is going to be because with shipping costs as all all of you know that uh, that has gotten out of hand um, I do have two parcels or packages that I do need to get together and send off. Um, I did uh, recently set up a an account with uh, Canada Post, so that helps with uh, a little bit of a discount on the shipping cost. But that all depends on where the package is going, and of course the size of the package, so how much it weighs and uh, the dimensions. So as far as the giveaway, I would suggest keep an eye out on the videos and hopefully you enjoy what um, I put out on those videos. Uh, yeah, so please watch them in their entirety. Uh, I'm sorry this kind of uh, Miss missing words or uh, long spans in between my words uh, doing this video. It is a little hard seeing the um, the screen without my glasses on so that doesn't help and uh, I um, hope to uh, keep you entertained and uh, provide something that uh, you're interested in. If you have any suggestions you can leave them in the comments. Um, if uh, you miss my live and uh, you have a question for me that you'd like answered please feel free put post the comment in uh, post the question in the comment section 
I do provide my email address. So if you don't want to leave a, leave it in a question in the comment section, you can always send me an email. Um, and you can follow me on Instagram. Uh, I do post quite a few pictures on Instagram of uh, what I've been doing, um, my projects, uh, the yarn dyeing. I did think that I would need to uh, dye the yarn that I'm going to be using for for this collaboration that I'm doing. Um, it I can tell you that it is a wearable. I do have this trellis yarn, or some people call it a ladder, ladder yarn. It is Burnett Matrix is the brand. I, and this is backwards, I do have lots of this, and I do mean lots. I have a chest that is almost full of this, and it is all the same color. So I am going to be mixing that with some cotton yarn. Which is the Cotton Fair. So I'm going to be mixing these two together. So what my plan was originally dyeing this black to go along with um, the trellis yarn that I have. But uh, I asked my husband what he thought and I did show him I, a picture. I did swatch up, did a swatch of the trellis with a light color like this. Not the Cotton Fair, but a yarn like this to see how it would work out. And he liked that, so I don't have to dye this one. So I will be using these two together. And that will be part of my Scorched Earth Challenge. So I will be doing an update on that. Um, just uh, within it in the first week of May. And uh, I hope that you uh, will join me and uh, watch my videos and Join, join us on our collab and possibly participate along the way. Um, we are doing a wearable and right now we are looking at doing a pattern that is uh, designed by Jeannie from On The Hook Crochet. Uh, we, may, we may or may not do the same pattern but it looks like we will be using one of Jeannie's uh, patterns. Um, I really like Jeannie's patterns. Uh, she does not have a small, medium, or large type um, where you need to put in this many stitches for, for this size. It is uh, a guidelines to make it to the size that you actually are. So if you're say 20 inches across then and you want uh, some extra room in it then you make your chain so that it's like say 24 inches across um, and then and that's the way her patterns are so whether you're a petite person or a larger person her pattern will still work for you so, um, I do kind of have uh, a pattern or two in mind. Like I say, we are still working out the, the details on the collaboration. And uh, that will be coming up. Uh, we will announce that. Um, so, like I said, uh, if you have any questions, Please feel free to leave them in the comment box. 
Um, and uh, I'd appreciate it if you'd start watching for my giveaway. I will not put giveaway in any of the, my titles um, because like uh, others have said, there are people that subscribe strictly for that and that's all they look for in your titles of your videos and they are not there to support they are there to hopefully take um, it is it is a give and take to an extent um, I give my knowledge hoping hopefully that you can take from what I put out um, in my in my videos for for you to learn how to how to uh, do or improve your craft and uh, we like to share with others so um, I will uh, post in not this video but it would be the video after um, the uh, the rules of the of the giveaway um, so uh, anyone that's looking for strictly giveaway um, videos that that are not necessarily in the titles will not be able to find it in the drop down box the description box of the partic particular video but you will know that the rules do apply even though they were posted previous to the video that will be the the giveaway video. Also too, um, when things get uh, better and uh, I'm able, I will also like to do uh, surprise giveaways, which would be using the random comment picker on random videos so people that do uh, comment might end up with this with a nice surprise that they weren't expecting um, also too I found that uh, by leaving comments on on uh, a youtubers uh, videos you will get notification of when the person puts out new videos if you go a long time sometimes YouTube forgets about you and because you haven't commented in a while they your um, the possibility that uh, your notification will get kind of swept under the carpet so um, with that in, uh, taking that, all that into consideration, I hope that you come back and look forward to doing another video um, when I'm more uh, awake and alert. And uh, this is uh, Lorraine from Chatelaine Makes signing off.